Hey everyone, today I'm gonna show you how to get Aquaman's Gladiator Armor and complete the second trial in the Aquaman event game. So yes, join the game, a link will be in the description down below and follow along to figure it out. So we're gonna start off here at the start point and you need to be level 20 to get into this trial. So make sure you go around and beat up some robots to get to level 20 before you get this started because you will not be able to enter the trial if you haven't. Now I'm going to show you the path to the trial teleportation device, so just look around here you can see that this is the spawn area and then follow along and it will take you right to the little portal. After following that super simple path you'll reach this structure here in the little lower pit of the map and here is the second trial portal. So head over here, press open and then you can go solo, party or join queue. I suggest you join queue or going a party but I'm gonna solo because it's much easier to go with other people. After a bit of loading you will get into the game, move a bit forward and you will get this cutscene that will show you a bit of the robot straight ahead. Now here are some chests, I think there are four of them, and each chest has a different ability that will grant you some special perks for the whole trial. So just pick one of the chests, it will give you something special. I'm gonna pick the chest over here, and when I open it you can see a little notification that tells me what I got, and I got extra health recovery. So now we're getting started with the task at hand. In this first room we just have to defeat all the robots and unlock the next part. I'm gonna speed this up because it's basically just defeating all the robots, but it has some tips to talk about. So in this first room we have wardens, mercenaries and boosters. The boosters are the ones with the green health bars and they are the ones healing the other robots. I suggest you begin by going for these ones because they will be really annoying when they heal the other robots. We then have the mercenaries which are the basic robots, they are super easy to defeat, just avoid their simple attacks and you should be able to beat them out fast. And then last but not least the wardens are the ones that shoot lasers, when they shoot the lasers just fly around them as much as you can and then beat them up as soon as it stops because then you will not take any damage whatsoever. When the last robot has fallen, the next room will open, you will swim in there and you will get a cutscene. I'm gonna speed this up a bit because it's basically you meeting this guy called Volko. He will talk about your abilities when it comes to speed, that you need to train those abilities, and he will give you a challenge to get through this corridor as fast as possible and get under the gate before it closes. Uh, use your speed ability that you have in your inventory in the menu to get under the gate super fast. If you're too slow, the gate will close behind you as you can tell right here, and if that happens, just head to your left you will have another room that you can go through by defeating some other mercenaries and stuff. In this next room we have to defeat even more robots and in this room we also have the force robots and these will pull you towards them and then they will shoot and blast at you which will do a lot of damage so I suggest you just swim away from these. Now I'm gonna speed this up of course because it's just a big fight but when you have defeated all the robots the next room will unlock. This room is going to be quite hard if you're alone because there's so many robots in the same place. But if you can, try to go for the boosters because they will heal the other robots and then go for the bigger robots to easily defeat them all faster. Now if you die, don't worry, it will just make you respawn again and you can keep going. We now defeated all the robots in that room and in the next room it's the exact same deal. Defeat all the robots and then the gate on the right will open up and you can get right through. So I'm going to speed this up and I'll be right back. When you're down, swim through the solo corridor up here and you'll get into this big room with a big button and a floating rock. You will get a little cutscene when you get in here, I'm gonna skip ahead. And what you have to do now is defeat all the robots in the room and then I'm gonna show you what to do with the rock and the button.
We've now defeated all the robots in this room, so swim over to the boulder, then you want to head into your menu, over to your abilities and bring out the air bubble, and then use the air bubble on the boulder. Now if you missed like I did this first try, you just have to wait for it to reload, and then make sure you, re you really aim for the rock, and then when you hit it, a bubble will form around the rock, and making it get pushed down onto the button that will unlock the gate right in front of you. Head through the little corridor here and then you'll get another cat's name with Volko. I'm gonna skip ahead but basically what he tells you is that you now have one last challenge for this trial. You have to catch him. So to do this you want to use air dash or air bubble from the menu, you can pull them into your hot fire like I did, and then you just have to swim right into him. Now to detect where Volko is, you can see the little exclamation mark, and that is basically where he is. Just follow him along, he will try to swim away from you, but it should be very simple to get him if you just use your air dash. Once you have defeated him, you will get another cutscene, and he will spawn the Relic of Endurance. And that will spawn right next to this teleporter right here, you just swim up to it, and you have completed the second trial, you'll get the badge and be teleported back to the main game. Relentus. So if you now go to your inventory on Roblox, head to accessories and then shoulder accessories, you will find Aquaman's Gladiator Armor right here and you will own it and be able to wear it on your character. So if you all found the video helpful, please like down below if you did and don't forget to subscribe and turn on post notifications so you miss any of the future videos and I will see you all in the next one. Bye. dead burden, even Ethan Gamer. That's the homies when they get together. It's wild. Now watch him take another win. I'm talking Island Royale. Duck, duck. Mr. Duck. Subscribe now.